Good morning and welcome to day two. This is the day of the concert and we are up early. We are getting our makeup on. I just got out of the shower and we have got a few things we got to do today. Number one, a Goodwill outlet. Yeah. Number one, coffee. And number one, the Taylor Swift concert. <laughs> right? Yes. Okay, so we'll be back. Just wanted to start the day off with this just to show you guys that we are up and ready to go. Okay guys, so it is 9.21 in the morning. Fifi is freezing her booty so off. Cold. I'm loving this weather because usually I'm sweating my booty off. So, yeah. Um, so 9.21, we are going to go number one find coffee. We've got to have coffee before anything else. Yes. Um, and we are going to go to a Goodwill outlet today. So that's going to be a blast, right? Yes. And um, we are wanting to be back at 3 o'clock or at 3 at, at the uh, at our room so we can get ready to leave at 5, right? Yeah. Or well, whatever. Whenever. Uh, 4? I don't know. I don't know when we're leaving. Yeah. I just want to say if you guys have not checked out the day one video, Go check it out. Um, there's a lot of good highlights and stuff in there of our day. And there's always there's always pictures at the end, so don't forget to look at those. Uh, actually, there is no pictures at the end of number one. I totally <laughs> forgot. So strike that. Um, so anyway, we will check in and out throughout the day. If we see cool things, we're going to let y'all see too. Mm -hmm. Bye. Okay, guys. Look where we are. We have found the first Goodwill outlet. We have also <laughs> found some Duncan. So I got a hot coffee. She's got an ice, even though she's freezing to yes. death. Because it's that's always, how she it's rolls. It's always ice coffee season. And what? it's peppermint. Yes, Dunkin' Donuts has their, their, their holiday season stuff out. Oh my yeah. gosh. They have the white chocolate mocha. I don't even know, like so much. But anyway, we are gonna go in here. I have a feeling I'm not gonna be able to film too much in here. If I can, I will. Um, but we're going to take a couple of sips of coffee and head on in. Hey gypsies. So we are in Indianapolis, but, um, I'm not put, including this in, in the day two stuff. We are just going to literally do a Dollar Tree haul right here, right now, right here, right now. Because right right I found some really cool stuff today. I mean, yeah, I mean, it, I feel like it was really cool stuff. But um, no eyeshadow palettes or brush sets. But you know, I did find something that I have never found before. And let me just let's dig in. Let me just dig in. First of all, um, when we was talking to Missy yesterday, we um, I had actually previously watched one of her videos, and she had a punch needle kit. And if you don't know, like these things are kind of viral right now. So every time I see a video of one, I'm like, man, I'd like to try that because it looks easy. Didn't they have like rugs like that back in like the I think days? you're thinking of latch hook. <gasps> oh, maybe, yeah, yeah, yeah. Latch hook may be different than this. I think it is. Mm. Um, but this is the punch. It makes it look really easy. So this was $5, but I've been wanting to try it. And that might be a cute thing to get like... The girls for Christmas, a little something to do. I mean, because they make it look easy. <clears throat> yeah. I don't know how easy it really is, but I wouldn't mind doing that. Do it. Let's do a taste sleepover. test. Okay. So she was looking for those popcorn marshmallows. Missy done got me hooked on them. Yep. Thanks, Missy. Um, but they didn't have them. <laughs> but they do have peppermint. They don't have gluten, right? No. Okay. So we're gonna try this. Yes. Let's open it and see what it smells like. Peppermint. Twist marshmallows. Oh my gosh. Okay, get one. Oh, that smells like a peppermint patty. These oh, have to be good. I just feel like it, it's Christmassy. For some reason, damn, it tastes like glycerine. I don't think that, but they smell so good and marshmallow, marshmallowy and pepperminty, but I don't really taste the peppermint that much. It's almost like, like chemically pepperminty or something. It probably is chemically pepperminty. Give me another one. <laughs> Here. I'm hungry. 
<laughs> okay. Now, I'm going to show you the books I found because I found some good books up in there, okay? Number one, A Christmas Read. Um, this is a, the name of it is a, a, is Christmas Present, and it's a new, from a New York Times bestselling author, which is always good, and I always like to picture myself. I can't say I always like to do this because I always plan to do it, but I never do it. Um, and this one's skinny, like, so maybe I'll do it this year. In the month of December, read a Christmas book, a Christmas-themed book. So, I got Christmas present, and then I found this. How cute is this? So, this is Love the Fur You're In. It is Sesame Street-themed. It is in celebration of 50 years of Sesame Street. It says, feeling a little blue, looking for a sunny day, let the Sesame Street monsters show you how to love the fur you're in with this collection of wise and witty, witty words and vintage art. Yes. So, speaking of vintage art, look at the cover, the front cover. How flippin' adorable is this? I love it so much. Oh, um, sorry, sorry, okay, so, um, yeah, so just look how cute it is, like, it's so colorful and beautiful and great, let me give you a couple words of wisdom from the monsters, express yourself, says Elmo, every dawn, every, every dawn is another sunny day, a good friend makes it all better, you know, I don't really like these, but I keep eating them, this is your life smile. I like the texture of them. The texture's great. Like, too bad they're not popcorn-y, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so there's that. And then I found this coloring book here. It is a Joanna Basford. Um, it retails for $17.99. This one's covered up, so I don't know how much it retailed for, but $17.99. And this is 30 Days of Creativity. It says, draw color and discover your creative self. Can y'all see? I was like, what? And so, it's just different things for you to do. Different little activities. Just different little fun things. I love this. Love this. Now, let me blow your mind. This next one. I'm like, what is that? I picked it up so fast. Would you look at this? This is Color, Empower, and Manifest. Guys, it's a, it's a coloring book that was made especially for me, I feel like. <laughs> right? Can y'all see this? Oh, my gosh. Like, when I saw that, I'm like, I can't believe it. So, I grabbed it up. Um, and there's, let me show you how it's laid out. There's coloring pages. And there's also words of wisdom and stuff. So, I'm going to pick a page and just see what it says. It's so cute. It's so great. Okay, here we go. Each morning, I wake up feeling happy and full of energy for the day. So, that's just a positive affirmation to start your day with. I love this. I am, my, my mind was blown when I saw that. I'm like, are you kidding me? So, there's the first bag. You want to show something you got? Sure. Um, oh, I got me some Snickers because... I like Snickers. And I'm hungry. Okay, when I go into the store and I'm hungry, look out. Look out. I was hungry too, so look out. I also, listen, I need lotion. My hands are so dry, you can't see them, but they're so dry. So I got some of this Utterly Smooth Lotion. And after I wash my hands, from the Goodwill. We did sanitize, but I didn't wash my hands. I'm going to slather some on. Okay, so I got, first off, I grabbed two more bags of these. This is not the best deal in the world. It's the freeze-dried candy. It's called Brain Freeze Rainbow Crunch. They are just like freeze-dried Skittles. Let me just say they are very good. So, if you like freeze-dried candy, or if you've never tried it, but wanted, always wanted to, Dollar Tree has these little bags, and you can kind of see, they look like little Skittles, um, and they are delicious. And then, I got the, these, um, 
No, I don't think. Oh, yeah. I got this uh, pack or two pack. There's two packs of highlighters. And they look like little Legos. And I just thought they were super cute. That might be good for um, Christmas bags and stuff like that. So you can kind of see right there that the highlighters, how they're, you just kind of pull them apart and use them. And then for the new baby coming in December, look at this little mitt. You slip this little mitt here over their little hand and it's a little teething mitt and I've never seen a little teething mitt. So they have been getting some really cute things in here lately for babies, like baby toys and stuff like that. And then I found these gizmo socks. My hubby will totally take these. These are, get, this is such an 80s movie, Gremlins. Um, I, every now and then we make ourselves watch it just because it brings back so many 80s memories. But look at the gizmo, how adorable he is. My hubby's gonna love those, I guarantee it. And then I got this for the girls for their next sleepover because they always like to use bath bombs. And these are so cute. They're little um, donut shaped. They look so real. Super cute donut shaped. And I don't know if I can. They smell. What's that smell? What's that? Wait, wait, wait. Bath bomb. Chocolate donut scent. Okay. I can totally see it. Chocolate donut smell. Oh. You smell it? Yeah. It smells really good. And these are, they're just so cute. I love them. And then I was wanting some, some of these. I was going to do my hair a specific way. Um, I might have Fifi French braided on the way for our trip home, but we'll see. Um, but I, just, I didn't think to bring any with me. Um, and then I found the cutest air fresheners. And I, you know how the Dollar Tree air fresheners are. They don't work that great. But I told Fifi, I don't care if these work or not. Like, I'm totally getting them. There's a lemon and an ocean breeze. And they look like literal cassette tapes. How cute are these? Now, I don't know how they work. Like, do, they, do you hang them up? I really, oh, I can smell. I can smell them. I like lemon. I'll probably give my hubby the ocean breeze because we're both cassette tape, you know, 80s, 80s babies. Not really 80s babies, but raised in the 80s, 80s teens. We'll put it that way. Um, and then I found these Haribo rainbow worms. I've never seen them before. They look like real earthworms, sort of the consistency. And they're about the same size of a nice, as a nice big old fat earthworm. <laughs> so <laughs> the kids will love those just cause they're worms, you know? Um, I bought me this for right now because I got to put my hair up because even though it's cold to her, I'm, I still break a sweat. So, um. I didn't bring one with me, so I went ahead and grabbed it. Um, check these out. These are little tongs that are Christmas themed, and these are so adorable. I got one of each because I love them. If you have like a Christmas um, party or something where you serve like, you know, uh, like ba basically a get yourself, get get your own food like a little buffet. type. Buffet, yes. <laughs> um, like we usually do like hot wings and stuff like that. Look at these. Would you, these are the cutest. These are the cutest ones, but the other ones are cute too. So we have those. We have these right here that look like mittens and they have that, you know, they look like crocheted mittens or something. They have those and then they have Christmas trees. How cute. Your little um, uh, smoked sausages or whatever, getting them out with those. How adorable would that be? I love that. You want to show something else? Sure. Um, oh, God. It's a star. <laughs> um, so I, if you watched our vlog yesterday, I don't even know if we showed this on there. I've been looking for these. Like, they're kind of viral right now. It's the limit, or it's the winter edition Red Bull. It's iced vanilla berry. And I fell in yesterday at the gas station. It was super tinier than this. This is like a regular size. Um, but I fell in at the gas station yesterday morning on our way and um, I fell in there. So I got it, probably have it tomorrow sometime. Get it real cold this night. Yeah, just leave it in the car, probably. Yeah. Oh, you wanna go get go, well, go, go. And the only else thing I got, the only else thing, the last thing I got was these antibacterial hand wipes with aloe and vitamin E. There's 50 wipes in here and they're in the scent of wild berry. Biopure. And um, I'm 
very excited about. Actually, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and open these. Oh, good. And clean my hands. <gasps> Do that. I don't want to smell them. All right. I have a Charlotte Tilbury blush dupe. This is in the shade Party Pink. And if you like your dupes, guys, this is a biggie. I mean, the, the container, it's just totally a Charlotte Tilbury dupe. So I had to grab one. And then, if you guys only knew how fast I jerked this thing off the shelf. Bro, I thought something was going on. I know. I'm like, oh my God, what's that? And there was only one left. Only one. One. And this is in the scent Vanilla Sugar Cookie, guys. So, this is a winter scent, right? Yes. I'm going to spray it just to see. Hey, give me that uh, clip. I'll cut the thing off. Oh, thank you. Oh. Yeah, it smells good. Oh, so this is another good. dupe. Saw that. Oh, oh my gosh. I like that. That smells really good. They smell good. Um, so this is a dupe, guys. And I know y'all already know because that's why they can't keep them in the stores. Because this is a dupe for the, what is it? I don't know. I never oh my know. gosh, I forgot. And then everybody's going to be telling me in the comments. And I always forget. Um, but anyway, it's is a dupe. Is that like a tea? It's a dupe. I feel like... I can't remember but anyway this smells really good and I looked up and found one so I was thrilled <laughs> okay and then I also found this this is a dual cream eyeshadow and um, the color let's see it just says swipe shimmer and go and you can kind of touch see, land touch land touch land for the hand sanitizer thank you um, so this is the color can you kind of see let's open it Let's open it and just, what's that? Jen's texting me. Oh. Okay, so let me show you guys what this looks like. So basically, you push it up to get the eyeshadow out. Oh, yeah. Like that. Oh, that's pretty. Yeah. And then let's do a little swatchy swatch. So okay. basically, you put it on your eyes. The only thing I don't like about cream shadow like is it, it creases. Yeah, but, but have you tried it with like, um... Oh, it blends really good, too. Timer. You see that? Yeah. I don't know. I haven't tried it in years. I mean, oh. <laughs> well, primer might make a difference. But this right here, um, I know that they're, that this is a dupe for something, but I can't. I don't know what it is. Do you want to wipe? Honestly. After I get done with the show and all this, I do. Okay. For sure. Um, okay. And then I just got these for Ricky because he loves little men's. He loves a little He men's. really does. So how she cute is that? She got a little truck the other day from Goodwill, and she gave it to him. And the whole way home, when we picked him up, he was like, do you have me a man? Do you have me a little man? I need a man to put a in little here. Man. It's learned a little man. Um, so I got these because I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm hungry right now. Right. Listen, I think we should find like a good place to eat. Before yeah. Before we go back. And then we can go back. We can even take food back right, if we Right, I'm wanted. thinking that. Yeah. Um, yeah, because we're going to eat. This is what we're going to do. We're going to eat a big lunch today. If you guys saw our video from yesterday... We had the most amazing dinner in my whole life. The best atmosphere. Oh my gosh. Everything. Oh my gosh. It was amazing. I wish we would have got those menus. Oh my gosh. Why didn't we? I don't know. Oh my gosh. We should have got it those was menus. super duper wow. dim lit in there. Like really, really dim lit. And we sat down and she's like, I don't know how I'm going to see this menu. And then she opens it up and it lights up. It's like two big iPads or something. It's amazing. It was amazing. So cool. So, the Caesar salad was amazing. The steak. That thing was The this. Brussels sprouts. Oh, my gosh. The, the mashed Brussels potatoes. Sprouts. It was. Everything was so it good. It was. The bread they brought. I got to eat it all because she doesn't mm -hmm. do bread. And then they had this, uh, like, house-made horseradish sauce. <sighs> and, the, and the steak came with au jus. That was good au jus. I could have put a straw in it and drank it. But the horseradish sauce, I'm so country. I don't, I'm not fancy at all. Like, they, it was like beside the mashed potatoes and like a little thing. And I was like, oh, dang, they done brought me a side of ranch. So I'm like taking a bite of mashed potatoes and dipping it down in the horseradish sauce. And I was just eating it. I didn't even realize. And then it dawned on me, oh. A horseradish can be spicy. Yeah, it like, had a little it, bit. A that lot. Caesar salad was spicy. Like, it had a kick to it. I don't it. know why. I can't I don't know. It. it was delicious. Like, I, I cleaned my It was so good, guys. That, that was the best meal of my life. Mm. 
So anyway, having said that, we are going to, yeah, I haven't said that. I was right in the middle of saying something. Um, we are going to get some kind of nice lunch. I don't know where. And just take it back. We're going to have a big lunch and probably just hardly anything for dinner. Because, what? Oh, I thought somebody was pecking on the window. Because um, we're probably not going to, we're going to be getting out of the concert late. Plus... I don't want to go fill in full and stuff, so I'm going to have my biggest meal of the day today. And we don't want to have day. to use the bathroom while we're there. No, we don't want we to. We ain't missing nothing. No, I will pee my no. pants before I go. I won't. Miss but a song. I'm not going to pee my pants, but I mean, I'm not going to say that. It's been known to happen, but <laughs> anyway, I want some peanut M&Ms. That's what I'm trying to say. Okay. It was a long way around peanut m and Right? Okay, let me put these back, and I got one more bag to show you guys. Okay, while well, you put that done. back, I'm going to talk about the, um, the restaurant last night. Okay. So, as soon as we sat down, because it was on the 20th floor of this motel, so as soon as we sat down, um, our view out there was the Taylor picture on the Marriott. Like, that was the first thing that we saw, and then it spun around. And so we got to see Lucas Oil Stadium, where we'll be today. And um, you could see down in there, kind of, but you could see that they were doing like light tests and stuff. So there was like flashing light, like strobe lights and purple lights. And uh, you could see the whole yes. city. We, we watched the whole thing go around. It was so beautiful. It was, it was so beautiful. <laughs> okay, so I got me one of those bio piers too. Um, yeah, so you already heard all about that. Oh, I got these for Fifi because these are new. If you haven't seen them, check them out. I'm excited. Yes, this is the Veggie Craft Pasta made with cauliflower. Made with cauliflower. Is it gluten free? Yes. Does it say? Okay. Yeah, it does say. Okay, so it's a blend of lentil, pea, and cauliflower flowers. Um, good source of potassium. This is a little old box, it's but. Just three ingredients. Usually she's just cooking for herself anyway, so. Um, but how cool are these? You got the penne, is that penne? Yeah. Yeah, penne and then the spaghetti. Listen, if that's good. You're gonna be looking for yourself. I'll be getting all kinds because you know, when I make pasta salad for everybody. Yeah, I'd like to try it in, in pasta yeah. salad. And I love a cauliflower crust pizza. Mm. Oh, that's my favorite pizza. The gluten-free pizza is from Walmart and it's cauliflower crust. Okay, so I got these for Christmas. These are sets of chopsticks. These are so cute. You get two sets of chopsticks per pack. They are, uh, this one is the Ninja. And they're bamboo. Ninja bamboo chopsticks. So there's what that one looks like. How cute are these? These are the boba ones. How adorable. And then these are sushi time. So, somebody in my family absolutely loves eating with chopsticks, so they're going to love that. And then last but not least, I got the dupe, and I'm going to do a taste test right now because I want to see how close it is. This is the, like, the dupe to the double stuff Oreos. They had, mm -hmm. they had the regular pack for $3.75, and then beside of it, they had the dupe for $1.25. So I'm going to taste test this and see if they really taste like Oreos or not. Because Oreos has a specific they do. flavor. Yeah. And I'm going to tell mm. you, the gluten-free Oreos, they're regular Oreos except they're gluten-free. You would never, ever, ever know the difference between gluten-free and non-gluten-free Oreos. The taste is just so good. I honestly feel like anything you make gluten-free, I would never know. Yeah. Totally. They don't, s they kind of smell like an Oreo, but then they kind of don't. We're exactly. My word's exactly. Let's try. You won't? Oh, no. Never mind. Been gluten-free for three years, and she still asks me. I don't know. It's very similar. Of course, it's not like spot on, but it's very similar. Maybe a tad bit sweeter than regular Oreos. I feel like these cookies, like in regular Oreos, I feel like the chocolate cookies are not like super, mm -hmm. super sweet. I feel like these cookies probably are a little bit sweeter. I don't feel like they're very double stuffed. I like don't know. double stuffed Oreos, you got a big thick layer in there. Yeah, but have you seen mega stuffed? 
OMG. Mm. Anyway, that's it. We just wanted to share this Dollar Tree haul with you guys and not be part of day two because day two is going to be big because it's the concert day. So I'm going to be doing a lot of filming in there. So anyway, let us know what your favorite item was from today's video. And um, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please subscribe today. Become part of the family. Also, if you're not following us on Instagram, we are posting a lot of pictures from our trip over there. I My Instagram. Okay, I'm posting. I I'm, a, I'm getting ready to post some more. Twisted Gypsy 32. Flea, F-L-E-A underscore bug. BG85. Okay, so go check out the pictures. And I'm going to post some pictures today. Okay, <laughs> all right, that's it, guys. Thanks for watching, and until next time, bye. Okay, guys, so we are getting down to the nitty gritty. We have our outfits on, and well, I, I still have to put, slip my coat on. She's putting her lipstick on. Look at the back of her outfit. It's going to be a little bit chilly tonight, or a whole lot chilly, mm -hmm. if you ask her. Yeah, so um, when she gets done here, she has a hood, and she also has, uh, I want, I want y'all to see her shoes. I guess I can go ahead and show you her shoes. I was wanting to get the whole shot, but. Ooh, that lipstick's great. Ta-da! Okay. Ta-da! I love them, I love them. And now the hood. The piece yeah. de la restaurant. Like, but you can have it in case you get cold. <laughs> I think it's going to be great, honestly. Can't see not here. Well, they keep getting sneak peeks of me in the camera. Oh, how cute! I love the look of that. Yes, that is so cute. Love it. Ooh, girl. <laughs> I love it. Okay. Tell me, are we on? Yeah. Okay, guys. So here's my Lavender Haze outfit, which the dress, Timo. Wait. She and what? Oh, no, something. Okay, wait. Go ahead. <laughs> okay, so this is my Lavender Haze outfit. This is she and the dress is Timo, the hoser Timo. And go ahead and show them my shoes. Boom, Boom. baby. TikTok shop because I can't handle. <laughs> No daggone anything. I love it. I love it. I love it. I straightened my hair, so we are ready to go out the door. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to have to show mine. Do you want to go sign that dress? Yeah. I've seen several of them. Uh -huh. that, that's a good idea. 
where they put the the the, per, the person that yeah. Is this our way in? Water cold beer, water cold. So what does our ticket say exactly? It's one it's section 108, but I'm wondering why it says 108 family restaurant. Oh, I'm sorry. So you ask somebody or? Being drunk and throwing up on myself. So a barrage of things. This is my lawyer and that's my Are you brother. Are you videoing? Yes. And, um, we made it! Is in here to and I feel like we got decent seats. Uh, yeah. <laughs> we I can. really do. I mean, they were so good. So, is this the screen that we'll be seeing her on too? Oh my god. Don't say what the hell. <laughs> <laughs> 